baba ya mtu i am not apologetic about it by the way if you come at me at you know you get me respect because hey dude wanted to kidnap me dude wanted to take advantage of me who am i to show respect to him and he doesn't respect small girls <laughs> Yeah, she broke me in my heart, yeah Yeah, she made me fall apart, yeah Be she barely on the right, yeah Yeah, she bad, she more than bad, yeah Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel In case you're new here, Karibu Sana, my name is Mudani And welcome to this family You're so much welcome, by the way And before watching this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button It's somewhere here Make sure you just hit it It's very free of charge Subscribing is just a way to show me that you love me Eh, hey, yes So please do subscribe <sighs> nimekuwa siku mingi before me vlogging hmm nimekuwa nikijipea excuses you know me guys i told you i don't like vlogging in my house because one uh, the lighting of my house mahali nyumba yangu iko like light iko ngi mingi so it's a it's an extreme spot kwanza ku vlog two my neighbors are very noisy like very noisy utaanza kusema hi guys usikie huko mama anasema nani kujua kwenye uji it's a rap and sasa hiyo ni mali mali naweza vlog here yes so that's why i just don't like but today i was like by the way come rain come sunshine need a vlog I'm actually from town. I was meeting up with a couple of friends over something and I decided to grab the camera. Mm. I'm a bit tired, but <clears throat> we're going to do this. We are gonna do this. Yes, and it's very hot. Kai, it's very very hot, but I'm so determined. Hmm? Leo nothing is going to stop me from vlogging. Yes, niko nataka muone niko na juice na ina match na top yangu. Yes, so today we are going to do a story time. Mm, a story time which is I don't want it to be offensive to anyone. Actually, if you're going to take it offensively, I don't think I'm apologetic for it. Yeah, wewe tu, wewe jam tu. Wewe jam tu. It's okay. Kujam ni sawa. Kila mtu jam. Yes. So, this story time is not like something which happened yesterday or the day before yesterday or it's something which happened like last year. No, guy. Imagine, yes, last year. Actually, it is last year, June. Hmm around june yes so it was this time i was moving out i used to stay with my best friend but now we agreed on just moving out story for another day yes so i was moving out and namnajua house hunting bile ni extreme sport so i needed to like get someone to help me in house hunting because actually mimi sidhani peke yangu na wezana na hiyo mambo you enter somewhere everything is nice but just this one thing uh it was just i just needed someone in short to help me the house hunting so see you know me just told stayed my best friend my best my best friend could not help me move out because alikuwa shaenda home at that time like well, it was during the holidays long holiday so then the other person the only person the other person i would text was my boyfriend and my boyfriend was like okay sure i will help you house hunt so <clears> hey <throat> sasa sindio mimi the day yo siku saa ya ku house hunt the first day ya ku house hunt my boyfriend at that time was in riru at his cousin's place she was staying there so me ni kachukua matatu ni kanipeleka town that is from home to town like my father's house to town then from town to riru 
if you know Riru, Riru is a place along Thika Road in Nairobi. For those who don't know. So, matatu nilichukulia Odeon, but siku chukua, siku panda basi. I pandad these small matatus. I don't know if you know them. This, of course you know them. I mean, yes. Izi matatu ndogo. So, na normally me, I just love sitting up a quad driver. I don't know why. I just don't know why. I just feel safer there. In case of anything, nitaona vitu zikienda wrong hapo. Mm. <sighs> Plus, um, nakunga paranoid about accidents and everything. So, napinanga tuku kapo kwa driver. Ndiyo, nione vitu zikigo, zikigo wrong. So, mimi uyo, ndi uyo mimi. Uh, nimepanda matatu, nimekaka, ndiyo driver. It was before COVID time. So, tulikuwa tunakawa tuwa wili ya pumbele. And, uh, yes, gari kinda, watu wakanza kushukia hapo USIU, around USIU. And the last person shukad at Kahaskari. And that person was actually the girl who was sitting next to me. So, siyaka shuka, sit kwenila kwenila. And mind you, this, this, this specific matatu doesn't have a conductor. I don't know, they... The our nanga conductor si Jindio was si do that one seat in your conductor and kalia someone a kayapo something of the sort it didn't have a conductor so I queen in the kibeba so when you meshuka ni wa meshuka na nivo akuna ingna na ingia so it's the last person she had at cars carry and me was going up to Riru bypass so Cindy oh Mimi immediately that girl she had. This driver starts vibing me. Indirectly. First alianza indirectly. Ata unge jua. So he, he started, he was like, hi, sasa, sasa, sasa mrembo. <laughs> I'm trying to imitate him, but siwezi. Okay, sasa mrembo. He was like, and I was like, poor sana. Then he was like, hey, ati, hey, si oflet kumenyesha. You know, trying to just get a story. So me, you know me, I'm a very talkative person. Maybe I am talkative. As much as I'm an ambivert, I'm an ambivert more of the extroverted side. So me, ni kama me, hey, baby, kumikuwa, adi na boeka na iweza, blah, blah, blah. Kidogo, kidogo, he takes my hand. You know, me, nikuwa ni meka, like, easy. He takes my hand. So, hapo, tuko hapo around KU. Mm, around KU. He takes my hand and I'm like, bro, Nike, what is wrong? Kona shida. So, me, I'm there like, una, unataka nini? Then he was like, now he's even slowing down. I drive mbio. He's like, unajua mimi, tangu pende matatu, nimekuona, sijui nini, roho yangu. <laughs> a lot of crap, a lot of BS, a lot of... So me, I'm there like, aki mze. <laughs> I even said I call him mze. Uh, aki mze. Mimi ni mtoto mdogo. I am even half your age. When mtuneza hita dad, like... Ninini unataka kusema tu kweli. Then he was like, unajua age is just a number. Ati hata tunaiza enda loji niko hapo. Umesema unashukia wapi. Wewe ni waroiro. Uh, kuna loji niko hapo roiro. Tunaiza enda unifurai. So me I'm there like, okay. So actually this guy wants something. So me... I don't know why I'm even calling him guy. He's a man. He's an old man. An uncle. An... Somebody's even grandpa I am. Because I can occur around like 50s. Upper 50s. Yes. So, me ni kamuambia. Hey, mimi. Mi ni mtuto mdogo. Na kama unataka ni shuke ni shukia hapa. At that point ni mahali... Nika shuka itabidi sani rudi hadi KU ndio ni chukue gari ingine. Kuzi tumeenda enda from KU. So me, he starts selling me. Unajua neza, neza kupeleka hadi juja. Neza overspeed hadi tuende juja. Kai. Woi. Unpurity mudhani. At that point I was scared. So I was there like. 
Okay, sasa mbona ufanye hivyo? I said even sasa tu nime change. I was like, mbona ufanye hivyo? Unataka nini? So, he was like, si nimekwambia kenye nataka. Then me was there like, wacha tufanye hivi. I'm going to riru for some errands. Pick my number. Chukua namba yangu. Ndio nikitoka riru ni kudungie. Now that I'm giving him the number because nimeanza kusikia mambo za ku overspeed na sina hiyo uwezo. By the way, I don't have that. Mimi kama kuna kitu naogopa, nikurepiwa. If there's something. So me uh he was there like ah naona sasa umeanza kukuparate. So me nikamsomea namba yangu and even called immediately to like confirm if the number okay my phone is dying mm. okay so sa sivani sivani camera ita ji place like venye ilikuwa ime ji place cuz simu yangu ilikuwa imekufa sasa hii sasa hii hata ni ku charge ni na charge sasa so nili interrupt venye ilikuwa anyway let's finish the story so si ni compare number ndio awachane na mimi ndio asinipitishe hadi juja imagine na ni juja mahali mimi siku anaenda ju mimi nafika ruiru na hata hiyo si route ya hiyo gari so me gave him the number and he even called like to confirm if the number is if the number is correct imagine so me aka call aka ona sawa then But then I forgot to mention your time when yana niambia unachana naweza overspeed nikupeleke hadi Juja. He locks this door na nini? Hapo kwa driver like ana lock aka lock his. I don't know if it's the way miss kwa na joy is mambo. Siko na joy driver anaweza whatever. Cuz mimi nilishika mlango nikasikia kcha. So he shot Ali lock. So me I was there like Then he took my number and said sasa naona umeanza kukoperate bla 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 So ni at this point Gioni venye nilikuwa na house hunt na narudi home because I mean nilikuwa naambia baba yangu nimeenda ku house hunt na kwetu huu wezi lala tu nje venye unajisikia baby <coughs> Ukosi kwako So sinko anarudi home so nikarudi home jioni. Jioni when I'm just relaxing, having a good time, I get a call. Guess who? The driver. The driver is like niko hapa riru. Uko wapi? So me. <laughs> Your point ndio nilimrushia matusi baba ya mtu. I am not apologetic about it but when if you come at me at you know you give me respect because hey dude wanted to kidnap me. Dude wanted to take advantage of me. Who am I to show respect to him and he doesn't respect small girls. Yes. So si akani akani pigia nilimwambia mwanaume mzee wacha nikuambie hivi You will never take advantage of another person from what nitakwambia. Then instead of telling me, "Why don't you come track me aliko?" Then I was laughing. I was like, "I'm at my father's house. Kujo ni toy uko." Anyway, this is a story time to just tell you beware of drivers. Of course you can't co- control driver moyo unapanda gari yake or something, but just be careful. Me nowadays, me believe imefika point hadi girls tunakuwa tunakuwa taken advantage of baka inabidi tunatembeanga na weapons kwa bags but these bags zetu zenye mnatonanga tukibeba <laughs> eh usi joke yes so please please men out there old men some of us are not interested in you and the girls who are interested in you will show the r if you ukitupa line kwa msichana usikie hataki vibe yako it's okay try another one try another one nataka kuna wasichana wenye sasa type yao ni old men go for them they actually interested like in you yes please some of us are not please not all of us are now if you see a girl out there dressed 
well dressed and beautiful and nini nini don't be so quick thinking that uyu msichana is so easy is just loose or anything yes story maisha make sure you hit the subscribe button make sure you comment down below make sure you share my videos i love you all stack simu zimike tena nikiongea yes yes bye bye na upenda sana subscribe sub subscribe